Thank you, Mr. Speaker. On Sunday, March 3rd, two days after the failure of this body to stop the mindless budget cuts as a quester that slashed millions of dollars from medical research, I was honored to join Bob and Suzanne Wright and thousands of others as we walked in downtown West Palm Beach to promote autism awareness, advocacy, and research. One in 88 American children is affected by autism, America's fastest growing serious de de developmental disability. And the Wrights will be the first to tell you that even with the progress of their organization, Autism Speaks, and other fine organizations, it'll take the investment of the United States of America in science to unlock the mystery of a disorder that cheats our children and stresses their families financially and emotionally. Mr. Speaker, the sequester will hurt our most vulnerable loved ones and risk slowing down our economy right when it's recovering. Let's come together now and stop the sequester and reduce our deficit in a balanced way. Instead of tax breaks for oil companies, let's give an autistic child a chance to be the best that he or she can be. Thank you, Mr. Speaker.